We have a G63 beast of a car, 5.5 liter twin turbo, 550 horsepower almost, zero to 60 in four and a half seconds. Customer brought this car in, he took it to two different shops, they wouldn't touch it, the wrap on there has been neglected. It's baked into the frame, baked into the paint, and uh, we've been removing it bit by bit. It was originally uh, hunter green or military green. The original color is black, but we're replacing, we're removing the hunter green wrap that's on there right now. The paint underneath has been affected because it's been neglected so long. And the customer wants to bring it back to its original color, which was a gloss black. It's not so glossy right now, but we're going to make sure that it does get to the point where he likes it. So this customer brought in a $10,000 specialized race bike. Wants to wrap it in all white. This customer brought us his 1968 Chevelle SS, gorgeous car. Brings us all of his cars. This time he wants us to give him an exact replica of the kit that was available back in 1968, which is an outline of a, a stripe that goes all the way around the vehicle. So that's gonna include fender stripes, door stripes, rear quarter panel, and the, uh, and the hood. So this customer brought in a brand new McLaren 570S right from the showroom floor directly to our shop here. He requested that we do a uh, carbon fiber lamination, not to be confused with a carbon fiber uh, vinyl wrap. This is actual carbon fiber that we laminate the panels and we clear coat it, several layers of clear coat, we polish it to a mirror finish. Absolutely gorgeous. You can totally tell the difference between that and a carbon fiber wrap. The customer was really happy and decided to wrap his entire car. Hasn't decided yet whether he wants a uh, black matte finish or a titanium finish, but I think it's going to look gorgeous. I love the way the car looks, I love the way it handles, I love the way it performs. It's a beast of a car. This car has power. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. We're in a 68 Chevelle Malibu. This was one of my dream cars when I was a kid. I had one up on my wall. Other people had Lamborghinis, the Countach, I had this. This customer got rid of the original 307 and dropped in a small block 305 Edelbrock. He tuned it up. He's pushing close to 400 horsepower in this, I think. Might be a little bit more. This is maybe a candy apple. Candy apple red. Listen to that motor. We're about a mile south of downtown right now. It's got incredibly sensitive throttle response. Incredibly sensitive. It's also got only 255 radials on here. It's the way the customer likes it. True car enthusiast, no doubt. I'm sure this 
single hit 60 and under. Four and a half, maybe even four seconds. Let me try to take off without chirping the wheel. You can't do it. <laughs> you can't do it. You gotta start in, I gotta try to start in third. Take off in third. Okay, check it out. I'm gonna stop. And I'm gonna try to take off slowly. And let's see if it chirps. I can't, it's, it's impossible. It's impossible. I'm, I mean, literally, if I squeeze my big toe, this thing takes off like a beast. So custom requested the original stripe kit on this car. And we did that for him. It's around the entire perimeter of the vehicle, from the front to the sides. And he's gonna bring us a 68 Corvette, which we can't wait to get our hands on. We do all the printing in-house, laser die cut. We do everything in-house. We're a full custom wrap shop, print shop. Yeah, sweet. What do we got here? Uh, these are fuel rail colors for, um, fuel rail covers for uh, Jeep Chalkhawk. Very cool. Yeah, yeah, I did them in carbon fiber with the red. It looks fantastic. Let me get a look at that. Yeah. What is this for? Uh, it's a, uh, for a Jeep drop off. You want to cool that out a little bit. Because Rami thinks the paint is peeling. So you had said like you got to use like a little bit of Bondo and like sand it on both sides here. And then you can see here on the top, look, it's peeling here. Like they just didn't. Okay. Yeah, so you just have to. Do it? You guys didn't do it now, someone else did it. So we're working on the fender right here for the G Wagon. We, the vinyl is very burned and very old. So we are heating it up and we're gonna use this plastic scraper so we don't scratch the car. And it comes off really smoothly at this way. So what do we have going on right here? So right now we're designing uh, some just uh, very simple decals for uh, the Pasta Sisters and the truck is outside and gonna do uh, cut and stick decals on their uh, company car. It's uh, one out of uh, 13 uh, um, vehicles that they have and we're gonna be uh, using almost the same design. It's just gonna be adjusted based on the van size and the truck size that they have for deliveries. So we got a Ford Transit van in here. Not the most exciting job, but we love it because it's a full wrap. This customer actually brought us their entire fleet before. And uh, we are re-wrapping it. So as you can see, it's black. It's been wrapped black and now we're wrapping into this nice copper color and she wants us to do all of her logos on the side. So she's bringing in the vans a few at a time and that's what we're working on right now. And so we have Ferris over here working on it. He's trying to stay out of the camera, not sure why. So Ferris, why don't you tell us a couple words about what you're doing here? <laughs> ridiculous. Absolutely <laughs> ridiculous.
So this customer brought in a Tesla Model 3 that we originally wrapped for them in a satin blue. Uh, we also did a chrome delete on them, so there's no chrome bits on this car whatsoever. It's all blacked out. Now he wants us to powder coat his wheels, and he also wants us to paint his brake calipers red. And I think it's going to look really nice when we're done with it. We love anything that moves on two wheels or four wheels. Or no wheels, boats for example. We do a ton of boats um, and we look down on no car, we'll take it all, we take all business. As you can see today we're very busy. Uh, we're very busy almost every single day and we love that. We love working on customer cars and we treat every car as if it's our own. And if we don't do something right we will redo it until it's absolutely perfect and the customer walks away with a smile. And that's not just some camera BS, it's absolutely true. You can ask about us, you can come in, bring your, bring your business here, and we'll show you what we do. And here he is talking about the movie Joker. Hi! One minute. 310 Call me. Change the boat, also scooter, you know. He do everything here. Uh, yeah, I got the access, no problem, hola amigo. Hey.